How's it going everyone? Welcome back. Hope you're all having a great day. Today I'm going to be playing a game called The Designer's Curse. This is actually chapter one of the game. I don't know how many chapters are supposed to be released, but the screenshots for this game looked really, really good and it's got a pretty high rating on Itch.io, so let's start this. Ooh, I already like that. I like the, uh, the lead in there, the, you know, what just happened there. Hello? It's me. So from what I understand, I think this game is, oh. Ah. So this game is apparently supposed to be somewhat similar to Amnesia and already just based on like the, the way the game is playing and like the things that you can do and like things that you can move around. Very much like Amnesia, The Dark Descent. Oh, I can even, uh, can even open the toilet. The turlet. All right, well, now that I've trashed the room, it's time to time to open this bad boy. Now I, okay. I can use Q and E to peek around corners. Uh, that is very much amnesia-like. The door is forced shut. Clearly I need some kind of mechanism over here. I'm very nervous, because I don't know what's in store for me. What's up with all these books? Is that self-analysis? Who reads books like that? What is this? To be honest, they're down there for a really long time. When they started to go insane, that's when um, that's when Master decided to set up the entertainment room. I mean, I guess he isn't as cold as he seems. The whole point of it was so that he could lock the door to enter to the entertainment room if anyone misbehaved as a sort of collective punishment. It was a strange room, weirdly out of place wallpaper and that mysterious piano sitting in the end of the room for that crazy one. But hey, it's something. They've got good books, too. I'll keep you updated on my escape. It may be a little ambitious. However, I'm planning on watching Master enter the code into his study. When I see it, I'll be sure to leave a note somewhere in the entertainment room for you, if you dare to escape as well. Good luck. The outside world is not as he portrays it. I promise. Okay. Well, that's a good, nice little setup there for this story. Oh. That's a big book. All right, what's in here? Oh, I don't know if I like, I don't know if I like this room. I don't think I like this room. This is very spooky and a bit dark for my liking. First aid? What am I gonna need that for? Psh. <laughs> oh, I didn't even notice that before. Right, is this the note I need to be at and look for? 314-216-893. Self notes. Uh, oh, okay. 314-216-893. Okay. Tab to close. 314-216-893. 893. 314216893. Alright, I got it. That's good enough for me. Shouldn't be too difficult. I'm gonna go around this way. I'm gonna go ahead and close these doors also. Okay, not going up there. It's way too dark. 314216893. Enter. Aha! Well, there we go. Ooh. I'm gonna go ahead and close this door. Just because I feel safer with it closed. Ugh. All right, let's go ahead and ransack this place in hopes to find any potential things. Ooh, a key. I guess that's really it. Seems to be all I can do in here. Oh, I can jump. I can yump. Is that a security camera? Why does he got a facing over there? That's weird. Oh well, nothing else I can do in here. Eh. Heavy door, hard to push open. Come on, there we go. We're gonna go ahead and leave that open for easy access. Oh wait. Forced shut. Okay, well. Maybe it's forced shut for good reason because I don't want that thing Anywhere near me. Oh my god, dude. Is that what I have to worry about? 
Okay. Okay, that was very loud. The door is forced shut. No added to notebook. Find a way out. You don't gotta tell me twice, dude. I'm already actively doing that. It would be nice if I had some sort of light. Another first aid. Why are you giving me so much? Okay, why can't I open this? What the hell, man? Why are you giving me so much first aid? That's supposed to make me feel better? It doesn't. It leads me to believe that there's nothing but horrors waiting for me here. Can I go in here? Oh, I can hide. Nice. All right, well, uh, control room is kind of inaccessible right now. What? What? Time to hide. Come on. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay, 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 okay. Now what do I do? 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 It's for shot. It's for shot. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. I can't do anything. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm 100% gonna die. What do I do? What do I do? Where do I go? What do I do? How do I get out? Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. He's coming back this way, dude. What the hell do I do, man? I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I have to try and find a way out. All right, I'm gonna wait until the Duke comes back and maybe see if I can find another way out. Okay, okay. Yeah, that's right, come this way. Come this way, you fool. You foolish fool. There you are. All right, all right, all right. Turn the corner, yes, okay. Ah, oh, stealth. Stealth, stealth, stealth. Four shut. Oh, okay. Here we go. There we go. Oh, oh okay. There I go. Oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. That was extremely nerve wracking. Whoo, this game is doing a good job of freaking me out, man. Okay, 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 okay. Yep, 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 yep. Yep. Another first aid. I'm just gonna wait for him to come in. That's it. That's it. Make your moves. Choose wisely. Oh god. Okay, okay, okay. Time to go. Time to just Ah! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Let me out of here. 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 What? How can he? Okay. All right. Oh my God, dude. Well, I can already tell this is not going to be easy. This is not going to be easy at all. I should wait until he's at like this end of the room. Come on, man. Taking too long. I don't have all day here. Okay. All right. Okay. Just keep on coming this way. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, come on, man. Ah. 
I don't trust this. I don't trust this at all. Oh, he's coming this way. Okay. Okay, okay. Maybe now is my time to shine. Just gonna stay. Here we go. Come on. Bring that down. Come on. Okay, okay. Crouch, crouch. Okay. Oh my god, dude. My heart is beating so fast right now. Right, go, 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 go. Go, go. No, 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 no. Down, down, down. Get up. Bring it down. Okay. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Hey, man, if you're looking for the key to open the lever cabinet in the control room, I simply left the key behind it for you. Also, please get someone to fix those doors. I know the main door down to the slaves area is locked, but in each individual cell, the doors swing a full 180 so that there's no lock. No way to stop the prisoners from escaping. Okay, uh, I don't know what anything is or where. He left it behind. Here we go. Boom. I don't know what that did. What was that for again? Lee, I don't know what that did. Is he still around? Oh! Oh, God! I don't know what this does, but... It's gotta be better than, uh, than what I was doing in there. Whew! This is really, really crazy. This is a really creepy game. How? Oh. Okay. Oh, it's bright. It's bright in here. Well lit. Good lighting. Okay. Where to now? A key is needed. Alright, I don't know where the key is supposed to be. Oh, okay. It's a pretty nice statue there. Oh my god. Strange painting. Why do I not, why do I feel like the old cellar is not the place I want to be? Why do I get that feeling? Why do I not want to be down here? Okay, I don't like this. I don't like it. Oh God. Yes, well done, Albert. The key is here. However, you may soon realize that the door to the west Hall above the cellar will now be locked. Oh no, boo-hoo, you must stay locked down here for three days. After all, you've designed the fracking. Fracking? There's not much I'm going to need from you for a while. If you dare disobey, your family will be taken out of the East Prison block and straight into the torture chamber, and later you'll be forced to use them as body parts for the creatures. Oh, and if you dare try to escape like last time and attempt to contact the authorities, I will instantly notice your absence. Then your family will be dead. I also don't appreciate your comment about the giant window in front of the test in one of the testing room bedrooms. Yes, I watched them at night, but only so I can quickly check if they are up to no good. I'm developing a new potion for you if you misbehave again. It will temporarily disable the right hemisphere of the brain, and you will not remember any of your creatures. Temporarily, I may need you again. I will force you to go through the halls of this house, having to deal with your own creatures that you designed yourself. Although I don't currently have a reason to put you through this, don't give me one. After all, there is a curse in being a designer. Okay. Well. I got a key. I 100% saw something. And it was a face. Okay, we're getting out of here. We're leaving. Goodbye. Into the West Hall. Okay, so where did this lead to again? I forget. Uh, there was a door somewhere around here. Yes, this one. Boom. I don't know what room that is or what it said, but... Oh. Yeah, this is definitely giving me very heavy amnesia vibes. Oh! Hello. What is this? C-O. I don't know what that means. Stop being so cryptic. 
C-O. I gotta remember that for whatever reason. Close that for now. I don't think there's anything useful in here, so. A light would be nice. Oh. Oh, there's oil level. Yeah, this is definitely A1. C0, A1. Well, here we go. That's plenty of oil. Okay, that light went out. That's all right. No problem. C0, A1. Steak sauce. A1 B9 C0 A1 B9 C0 A1 B9 I think I get it. I think I get it. A1, B9, C0, and what was D? What was D? D2. D2. Enter. Alright, I'm going into the designer's room. I wonder what this means for me. Oh, it's nicely lit in here, too. 3rd of August. Initially, I was puzzled by the hall outside this guest room being riddled with rocks, and I wondered how it could be that the West Hall is clearly above ground, but this area on the same floor appears to be underground. I was told this was due to the mansion being on a steep hill, which makes sense. I do not feel safe. Areas of the study are collapsing and filled with rocks and dirt from above. How do I know this will not fall on me when I'm creating the creatures, or even worse, sleeping? Master will simply come find me and bring me to the torture rooms if I dare complain. I'm terrified for my life. On the bright side, I've put together the new torture monster for Master last week. The Fraken. Fraken. So I was given a bed. She is perfectly capable of attacking due to the sharp blades in her left knuckles. Unlike the other creature, Spiky, who attacks prisoners with teeth-like fingers. However, the woman who modeled the head of the Fraken had her eye removed during torture. Therefore, she may have depth issues when attacking and will not be entirely accurate. I gave her the husband's strong legs, so she will be fast, though. Do I find it messed up to be taking people's family members in which my master has grudges against and turning them into horrifying creatures? Yes. Is it better than dying? I previously thought so, but now I feel like I should end my life. As the fracking came into my room la again last night, and I feel I have no reason to go on living. Well, geez, that was a mouthful. Is that the fracking? I think so. I don't know if I'm even pronouncing that right, but... Anyway, let's go in here, whatever this leads me to. Oh, that doesn't look good. Door is forced shut. Okay, then. Oh, all right. It locked behind me as I came in. So... What now? Oh. Oh, here we go. Very nice. Testing area below. We oh, I thought it was gonna fall down. Is this really? Oh, it's going on its own. Okay. Oh. Well, there I go. Uh oh. Uh oh. Order oil below. Apply to body and clothes, and you will not be noticed. Oh God. <laughs> I don't like this, man. I really don't. I don't like this. I don't like this. Come on. Why is it impossible to open stuff when crouched? Well, I found a key. Oh, 
Okay, 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 okay. I was walking directly towards it. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god. Okay, okay. I think that's the door I have to get to, maybe? Or was there even a door? Where the hell did it go, dude? There it is. Um. There we go, there we go. Okay. I made it, I'm safe. Oh my god, dude, this is incredibly nerve-wracking. Oh my god. Okay. I don't like the way that looks. I don't like the fact that that locked behind me. I should probably find a place to hide. Okay. Okay. Oh. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. I don't like the way that looks. Why are you coming towards me? Why do I have a feeling it's going to open anyway? Okay. Okay. Oh, God. Oh! Oh! Yes! My God. Whew! Well, this was incredible. This was really, really, really good. This 100% captured that really, like, dark feeling of dread and adrenaline that Amnesia captured. Now this game is extremely similar to Amnesia, but it has like its own unique bits and pieces here and there. And for chapter one, I mean, it gets right into the action. There's no like really long winded kind of introductory sequence. The monster is extremely terrifying. And you know, it does the same thing as the creature from Amnesia that it makes me just not want to move at all. It's just that terrifying. This seems like a really promising game and I look forward to seeing like the next chapters, however many chapters there are gonna be, because I think I'm definitely gonna to wanna to get into this deeper. If you guys wanna try this game out for yourself, I highly recommend it. This was really good. I'll leave the link down below in the description for you. But as of now, that's all the time I have left for this video. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you hit that like button down below if you did, and please feel free to leave me a comment and let me know what you thought about the video down below as well. And if you liked it and you wanna see more, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you can catch a new video up to five days a week. Thanks again for watching everyone, and I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Take it easy.